Canberra and Capital Territory Tourism Information. Just like the District of Columbia in the United States, the Australian Capital Territory, ACT, is a region that has been put aside as a separate regional entity. The reason for having a separate entity known as the ACT was to separate the lawmaking parts of the country from the major urban areas of Sydney and Melbourne. The goal was to separate urban interests from lawmaking, and hence the reason for Canberra and the ACT. The ACT is home to around 300,000 residents, most of whom live within the city boundaries of Canberra itself. As far as tourism goes, the ACT can be reached by land via car or train, and by air through the airport in Canberra. Getting around the city itself is also reasonably easy, and as with most national capitals, you will find that many of the residents work for the federal government. There are a couple of interesting tourism ventures you can pursue relating to the government. Firstly, you can visit the Parliament House and get a free informational tour of the area. Secondly, you can actually have an inside peek into the running of Australia by visiting Prime Minister's Question Time. This is a special session of the Parliament, where the opposition parties get to ask specific questions of the Prime Minister. Something that only happens in select Commonwealth countries. Education is also heavily on display in the Canberra area. The Questicon is Australia's version of the Smithsonian and there are a lot of interesting exhibits and displays for people to see. In addition to that, Canberra is home to three different universities, all of which offer daily tours of their campuses. Australia is an excellent place to study, so if you have children that are of the age where they need to start considering post-secondary education, this is a great way to combine a vacation with seeing some international universities. In addition to these special areas of interest, there are all of the staple tourism activities, like hiking, boat riding and anything else you would expect from a beautiful area, with tropical weather. All in all, there is definitely a lot to see and do in Canberra and the Australian Capital Territory.